Kaiser San Marcos Medical Center opens Wednesday, giving North County members another option for care. But some Kaiser nurses say while more access is good, staffing at Kaiser's other hospitals has been hurting. It's morally distressing as registered nurses to not be able to do our job properly and take care of people the way we want to take care of them. Megan Davison is a registered nurse at Kaiser and a union leader. She says some staff have been transferring from Kaiser's Zion and San Diego Medical Centers up to San Marcos. She says in the short term, that means less nurses in those hospitals. There is a direct correlation between safety outcomes and the amount of staff on the floor. Davison says she and others have been told travel nurses are being brought in to help, but says that's a temporary fix. We need the proper resources, the proper staff to take care of the community in San Diego, and that's what we're asking Kaiser to do, to sit down with us, hear our suggestions, both long and short term, and come up with a plan together. In a statement, Kaiser officials say all of its medical centers in San Diego, including Zion, San Diego, and San Marcos, are fully staffed, and they meet or exceed California's mandated nursing staffing ratios. Davison says the nurses union has negotiated better staffing ratios with Kaiser leadership, but. And that's broken on a daily basis. When you're understaffed, there's this feeling like, just a little visual, like you're in a parking lot. Cars are, all car alarms are going off, right? Which one do you address first? Kevin Soriano is a registered nurse at Kaiser's San Diego Medical Center. He says he feels the shortages and is speaking up for his patients. We're not just asking to have all these staff or all these people just to work in the hospital to make our jobs easier. It's not that, because like I said, at the end of the day, it's about providing the adequate personnel to take care of the patients. Kaiser officials also say patient safety and providing quality care is a top priority. The health system says the safety of staff is a top priority too, and they're continuing to invest in nurses. Matt Hoffman, KPBS News.